me way it up for you. Want a big one? Yeah. Hazel Turner has been a waitress at the White River Fish Market for three decades. She says there isn't just one best-selling item. Really, everything, because <laughs> everybody eat everything. They get shipments two to three times a week from the East Coast, the Gulf, and the West Coast. With the hurricane headed to the East Coast, they know they could see an impact. We made a list of things that would possibly be a little short on, like lobster and the mussels, and scallops, and clams, cod, and oysters. But with such a large selection of other fish, they're not worried about business. Tulsa based Melton Truck Lines ships raw materials all over the country. When we came in this morning, we had to check with all of our customers up and down the East Coast. Some were open and receiving for a few hours. Some had already boarded up. Hi, Harold. Thanks. He says their first item of business, make sure the drivers are safe. Next, determine when they will get to deliver or ship out. Some customers are telling us maybe Wednesday for deliveries and shipments. Some don't know, and obviously we won't know the full impact until the storm is over and we know about power loss and, and damage. But with this storm's potential reach, they're fearing the worst. This particular storm is going to have a major impact on the entire country. And I say that because not only are we dealing with the immediate storm today, but this is going to have a lingering effect as we go through the week. <laughs> Thank you. But back at the White River Fish Market, they're staying optimistic. And hopefully, hopefully. It may not be as devastating as they say it is. So.